All right, guys, so this is day two of me going for this, and it happens to be the last day of the event. This is the Nightmare Quest for Lizette. Um, I actually didn't finish the last Nightmare Quest. I ended up farming, I forgot what it even was. I don't even, because the last character was Revelka. I'm not entirely sure what it was, but the way I changed, I had my Lizette here on Nightblade, but after playing the level a few times, I kind of, just started thinking like I probably don't need to have Nightma Nightblade for the chain so I actually changed her to Spellblade and then I maxed out her basically her defensive abilities and taunting spell so she should I have a feeling that she's kind of designed to, to take a lot of these hits um actually I lost in Nightblade they have uh resists double resist so I end up losing that, but that would have been a good one too. Uh, but Pugilist does have a breath uh, breathing technique. Oh, I didn't realize that was on the sub job. I haven't actually used Pugilist all that much, so I I'm like very not knowledgeable about Pugilist. But he but Pugilist does have Iron Body Stance, which raises HP and defense. So I have Providence of Water, that's magic resist, magic attack resist, and HP and attack up. Oh, I thought that was HP and defense, or I thought that was HP and spirit. But this also gives a little bit more, well, it reduces magic attack damage. So she's pretty much a spell blade. Um, she's just designed to take some magic damage. I have her, I probably should stack a little more defense on her, but I have her with the this coat here oh 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 no oh. fittest lacerna 16 spirit so i just gave her a bunch of defense so even though she's not she's got 52 bravery and her resonance i think is now on level three and it's not even a defensive esper so i probably should have done that first um and yeah i gave her leonis castle which is at half strength because it's a sub vc but it's going to give her a little bit more spirit and defense. So I think I'm thinking i um, kind of liking this. Um, she's still going to be pretty slow. So I think I'm going to start off with Taunting Spell. Just let her take all the damage. If she needs a heal, Salir is there. But I have gone through this a couple of times. I haven't beaten it yet. But what ends up happening is eventually I do get earth units that kind of destroy me with pretty quickly uh Livial is kind of a problem because she has an enormous aoe and even though she's like really slow or like the player she i think she goes as soon as she spawns or something like that so it's a little difficult to deal with her with a lightning team all right so let's try the lightning team again um i'm probably gonna try one or two tries and if not then I might even try to do this off camera or just farm it or maybe just use a different team. I'm not really sure what exactly I want to do, uh, but I do want to start off with a revitalize here. I just don't want my cloud to be running out of AP. All right, so Salir, she's going to kind of stay, she's going to do some stuff here, but I'm going to keep her in the back, sort of healing. I'm going to try to get Lizette up front as soon as possible. I think I like Saintly Wall and Ibarra. And guys, I'm, I'm using like pretty strong units here. So, but um, I think actually he has, if I have him on, on Nightblade, he should have double resist. So that's actually pretty good. So I probably should have thrown that onto Lizette, but the missile type units are on the left here so might as well just do that on this side oh and this guy actually backed up so okay so there's a little bit of missile resistance all right so lizette you're gonna kind of come over here away from the missile units and just start off with a taunting spell that's 76 percent accurate so clearly I still need some work from my Esper. 
So the Kraken is over here being a Kraken. Um, I think I'm going to start off. Let me see. Nine is. If I could just knock out the chain right away, that would be nice. But maybe, maybe it's not time to do that. Let's, let's just see what I can do. Triple slash. Doesn't really do all that much damage, to be honest. Uh, so looks like that guy's going to be going again. And so is Ibarra. So maybe I'm going to throw down a heal here. See how long it takes. Um, maybe I'll just make a f do like a forward heal. Um, then I would have to place Salir in a better spot. Now you know what? I'll just put it here and leave it on panel. And I think the healer is pretty annoying on this map, but kind of part of the problem is I think if you kill kill that healer, then that's that's what causes like most of the spawns. So I want to do damage to this guy, but I don't want to kill him. <laughs> and Bar is looking a little super strong right now. Don't want a taunting blade. Blade bash doesn't reach. Is Zoya, is Zayo, is Zayoi. Airpin dart doesn't reach. Lightning shroud, maybe lightning shroud. And let's see if 9s can just finish off the chain here. 9s has not done his AP. His AP generation ability, so. Gotta be mindful of that. And looks like Luartha comes in and use, does her turn as soon as she comes in. So she, looks like Lizette is taking damage pretty well. All right, so Cloud is gonna come in here. Uh, wait, I could do a barrage. That might be a decent one, decent uh, attack. But I could also do a triple, triple slash. I don't want to be going too crazy with the triple slashes, though. Only got two left, and but Barrage is 40 AP, cross slash. Oh, I do have triple trick, so... A cross slash seems to be doing pretty good work right there. So does Braver. I think I might go for cross slash. And so we have that... Uh, That water mage back there, which probably I could probably take care of him with with any of these lightning units. Um, I kind of want this girl to keep boosting her. So let me go with magic barrier, boosting her defenses. So that's looking good so far. So Lear, can she actually reach with anything? I mean, I can hit him. I don't think I could like totem or anything like that. So maybe I'll just delightful demon. Kind of fitting for Salir to be honest. I probably should have done that first, but yeah. Alright, so Ibarra. Let's see if we could get a big hit here. A nice wailing storm. Sounds about right. And I kind of want to have everyone like pretty close to forward so that when Livia all spawns in, we can sort of jump her, but I feel like she's going to go before us. All right, so looks like this mage guy went. I do want to kill him. However, I do want to save AP as well. Stun blade, 36% chance to stun. 25% on Lorotha, that's actually pretty good. Linear Spear Shot. So maybe I'll try stunning Lorotha. There we go, so... It's one less turn to worry about Lorotha. Let 
and maybe I could start working or continue working on her. Ooh, or barrage would be quite nice. Um, the white mage I think triggers the next like a lot of the waves, so I'm gonna leave the white mage alone. And Lizette might need a little bit of a heal, but I think she's pretty good for right now. Uh, I think breathing technique. She does have really breathing technique from Pugilist, but I think that's under the sub job, not the main job. All right, let's see if. Okay, so Lear goes pretty quickly there, so that's pretty good. And then Ibarra, she can heal herself, technically. But I think I'll just move her up to like here. So I think a few, like a good amount of my units have the abilities to heal themselves. Oh, so it looks like we got Lorenzo without Livy all, so I might try to back up a little bit here. Iron body stance. That gives defense up. So I think I might do that. Sort of back up a little bit. I feel like Lorenzo's gonna come flying in. If I don't do something about that. But I think he does have like horizontal jump. So definitely gotta be super careful. I think this is a good time to Ember Light Vitality. Hmm. So I gotta be careful too that Lizette's hate might be going away. So just gotta keep an eye on that. I, as much as I wanna move Cloud in, I have a feeling that all right, I forgot these guys are pretty, pretty, pretty ridiculous. All right, so I'm going to try to leave some space open for Ibarra here. I kind of feel like as soon as I kill these guys, um, the next wave is going to come in with Livial. That's going to be a little bit of a problem, but these guys are our major problem because they got jamming thrust. They're about to go next, so. Okay, so here comes Tyrell and the Mind Flayer. And it looks like Livial is going pretty soon. So I might try to stun her with 9S. And then I need to heal with Salir. And try to keep her away from... Like far enough away from Lizette. She doesn't get wrapped up into any AoEs. But I need to move her two squares closer, so that might be a little bit of a problem. Alright, so Tyrell is kind of annoying here. For sure. Um, I just oh he's gonna go. I just need to get the heat back onto Lizette. So pretty decent damage with Brain Rush. But I'm not going to be able to keep the pressure to keep her from going again. So the chain is going to break 36% chance for a stun. Yeah, I think I need to keep her keep 9S as far as possible. Just so I don't get triple AoE and I'm definitely going to get triple AoE. Healing power down. Oh, double AoE, that's not too bad. Alright, so Lizette still has some hate on her. Which is probably good. Um, I just need to keep her healed up. And maybe add some more hate. She's not doing anything in terms of damage. But Lorenzo's definitely coming. Oof. Oh, the hate still goes up, so that's okay. And I just need to keep her healed up. Um, and then Livial, if I could get rid of Livial and or the mage, that would be great. I don't have enough to do any of the AoE attacks. So Izoya for 23, 24. Cloud is going to go next. 
Blade Bash doesn't reach. Hairpin Dart. 16. So please, Cloud, please go before this heal. And please do a lot of damage and please still have AP. Oof, that poison, not good. Alright, so hopefully Cloud can do some damage here. Oh, I do have Ascension available. Triple Slash still available. But I think I would hit Ibarra's. But actually, Ibarra doesn't take that much damage. Uh, what about Barrage? Of course, they want to go for the... What's his name? Okay, so that doesn't do enough. Maybe I should try not to hit Ibarra. That would probably be a good idea. 43. Sharpshoot? Just out of curiosity, Sharpshoot is only 19. So that might be the way to go. Braver, 15. That's actually not bad. So probably Braver. I have six Bravers, so... And I want to move Cloud back over here towards Salir. Because I feel like problems are about to happen over here. Oh no! Okay. Alright, so that could be bad. It could be worse too. So we can we can we can probably still try to revive at least. Ooh, the blind on cloud. I don't like that at all. Let's see what Lioness could come in here and do. He could definitely kill this mind flayer. I reckon. Maybe I don't have to go that crazy. Regular hacking seems to do the trick. Um, linear spear shot. May kill with a crit, but I don't want to take that chance. So we're doing okay. We just can't lose another person. Alright, so let me just not take the chance. I don't like the poison on Salir, and I don't like Lorenzo running amok here. Alright, so that's okay. Let's see if I can start pegging away at Lorenzo, because he's going to be a problem. I'm just out of range for Lorenzo. What does Scorpion Sentinel do? Tail laser in range for Lorenzo. It doesn't do much. Oh, it lowers his missile? It lowers his missile. Okay. I think Cloud is my only missile right now, so... Hmm. I don't think I could reach with Braver. Cross Slash. Mega Slash. I don't really want to do that. Poison Arrow. That might be a good option if he can get poisoned. No, he can't. So I don't know. Sharpshoot is looking like the play. Ascension. Did that, could that reach? No. Was there something else that could reach? Mirage. Um, I think it's safe to kill the the Kraken, but he's also pretty sturdy, so let me see if I can move in here with, I mean, this, oh, she's actually pretty bad in terms of AP, so I'm going to have to do a Saintly Wall again. Alright, so it looks like he went for Cloud. And I don't think I can heal fast enough. But it's worth checking at least. Lorenzo's gonna be a problem. Oh my lord. Maybe I could charge a bolt surge onto L Lorenzo. Is that possible? Yeah, I don't know why they don't allow you to do that. I guess it's only with AoE. But, uh, I don't know, man. I think Cloud might die from this. That's the problem. I can try to get this kid over here, Tyrell. Lower his single unit resistance. I can try to poison him, maybe? Or maybe just flare. No, I think Bolt Surge, probably. How did she get poisoned? Was that from Tyrell? 
Um, I don't think Lorenzo jumped here, so I'll just stay in this spot. Yeah, and there goes Cloud. Yeah, so that's going to be a problem, and I'm not going to be able to revive both of them. Neuro hacking. Oh, I wish Salir could go first. Spinning slash, drain rush. Maybe I could drain rush and build a chain. Cyclonic. Yeah, so maybe it's better not to move him. Can I reach with drain rush? No, I can't. Alright, so maybe it's better to move him. Go with Drain Rush. Alright, Ibarra, I need you to do some work here, girl. And she's not gonna do nothing. All right, I need you to back up here for a minute, girl. All right. I think I should probably bring a legit healer with actual full life. That might be a good idea. And maybe I didn't really need to bring it an entire lightning team. All right, so Sentinel might be good. Saintly healing I don't need quite yet. Shrill laughter. That might be useful actually. Cause I think they can both get stunned. But let me not, let me not move closer because Lorenzo is too much of a threat. Oh, there is a good stun. Lorenzo must be stopped. And Salir is about to get destroyed. So he's probably going for 9S, I guess. Oh, I thought she lived that. Oh? Did Tyrell just get healed from Lorenzo's jump? Is that what happened? Is that what really happened? Can I check his moves? All right. Oh, he's weak to frogs. Alir could have frogged him. So plus 50. Is that a resistance? Yeah, I think that's a resistance. Oh, he's weak to frog. Not weak, but like susceptible. All right. So this is not looking super great. Another drain rush might be okay. Cons wait, considering Salir just died, we all we have left is Ibarra, and uh, and Nine S of course. She can reach, so goodbye, Tyrell. Dragon's eye. So. There's no way for me to heal 9S anymore. And he's out of AP. I don't know if these if this is to mobilize for three turns. Lowers enemies or resources. Chance of inflicting immobilize. Immobilize ain't gonna do enough. Alright, so double shield deployment. Doesn't have range. deployment raises defense and spirit double resist raises all right let me try double resist help against lorenzo lorenzo's the big problem right now can't reach him can reach him can't reach lorenzo all right so i might have to just get sturdy right now And separate Sentinel. And we do get crystals. I completely forgot about that. And this guy went and grabbed it. Well, he stepped over it at least. Alright, so let's try. I don't think I can stun. Oh, I can't. St I can't stun actually. Um, if I don't go, then. Lorenzo goes first anyway, so I can try to stun. But I still have a drain rush. That's not gonna do enough. It's not gonna do enough healing. I can try to drain rush the mage. 
not, oh, his healing power got reduced on top of it all. So my best bet is the stun. 25%. No luck. Ibarra, let's see what you can do. Help me out here, girl. All right, not enough. Play Bash won't reach. Izoya. Izayoi. Izayoi. Airplane won't reach. Lightning Storm. Not enough. Lightning Shroud. Raises own CT. There's no way I could reach with the Blade Bash. So I guess Wailing Storm is going to have to be. Hope that uh, 9S survives here. He just jumped instantly. Oh my god. Hmm. Step into a crystal. Ah, it's just not going to be enough. Let's see. Great storm. Actually, I think that has a chance to immobilize. Stun. Okay, well, I'm going to have to Sentinel probably. Drill Laughter. Drill Laughter might do something, actually, so go for that. Neither of, the, neither of them get hit. But they still do generate the AP, so not the worst. Okay, that kind of hurts. Hey, we'll have to Sentinel now, I guess. Ah, uh, all right. I was close, but I don't think I'm going to make this, obviously. Okay. Well, actually, I could go for this stun. I think this is probably a way better chance of stunning. I can stun two of these guys on this side. See if I could keep myself alive for a little bit longer. Oh, good. 9S gave a crystal. Nice, preemptive. Alright, let's do a saintly healing. Should I just wait here? Actually, I, I lap Lorenzo, so I might as well wait here. course with the shell lightning shroud taunting blade blade bash that would be hilarious that taunting blade is way too expensive what am i ta what am i like no <laughs> ct up so oh counter dragon blade It looks like the mage is out here attacking with normal attacks. This guy might also be out of AP. The uh, Kraken. Lorenzo still got plenty of jumps apparently. Ouch. I kind of got blocked off a little bit, so I'm going to have to Saintly Healing. <laughs> Just holding on by a thread here. Lorenzo with a jump. He has access to a lot of jumps, apparently. And Saintly Healing again. Probably has like horizontal jump, dragon dive. All right, so it looks like at least Lorenzo is out of reach. I want to keep maybe do I have a Sentinel? Saintly healing, Saintly. Divine Grace. And none of those are all that useful. I can try another Shrill Laughter. Nope. The Fall of Night. What is that? Magic Attack, Man Eater. Magic Attack Resistance, Piercing Rate for three turns. That sounds lovely, actually. 
see if I could get a big AoE here. Nice preemptive. Alright, so I might be able to take out Lorenz. Ooh, I might be able to do a double takeout here. Ibarra with the beast in out all of a sudden. That was amazing. Okay. Let's see what I can do here. Malevolent Lightning. Can I kill Lorenzo? I can kill Lorenzo. Can I do something else? Oh, that's my only AoE I got left. So Blade Bash is not going to do anything. Um, if I go before moving. How much TP does this thing, this mage have? No TP, so no heals left. Good, perfect. I got all the TP from the crystals. Is Zoya... Hairpin dart. Play bashes. Uh. Right, so my my priority here is Lorenzo. 58. Because he still has the dragon blade, so he can still counter. So goodbye, 58 AP. But well worth it. She could get lucky with the preemptive. That would be nice. I got a couple of saintly healings left. I have a lot left, so. All right, so I think, well, oh, very good. All right, so I, I might have this actually. So the only missions I, I won't be having are the KO and the, all missions at the same time, but I, I might just try this again with a different team. We'll see what I do. Well, maybe I should Fury Surge here. Alright. Definitely Saintly Healing. Nice preemptive. Oh, wow. This is actually working out. Did he just go twice? What a jerk. All right. Hairpin dart, blade bash. Blade bash can technically stun. 48% chance. Hairpin dart. I used up everything else. Got us a nice crit. And that should be enough for the kill next turn. Oh, no. I need to. Well, I'll just heal. And we'll have enough AP. <laughs> oh, oh, it doesn't get the kill. The Fall of Night raises my magic. Okay. It's the same thing as similar to Fury Surge. And that should be good enough. All right. You know what? I'll take my not four star clear, not five star clear for right now. But I still would need to use Lizette to get the five the five star clear. Else I'm missing out on 200 mind spheres. So I'm up to 208. I mean I could try to farm the rest, I just don't really want to. All right, I think I'm just going to leave it there for in terms of recording. So thanks for watching. Uh, yeah, I think the lightning team is a little too susceptible to Lorenzo. Well, at least I got my lightning clear, right? So that's not bad. Um, I can get 40 more from here. Then I need 160 total. I'm just trying to figure out if it's worth farming or if it's worth trying to do this again. I mean, I could try to go for the no KOs. That's definitely it. And I'll just use like a mixed team this time. I don't have a problem with that. Um, just Let me just try to look. So I could just take out like maybe Ibarra or something. 
I don't really need to be using like that OP of a team, but I don't really have any lightning healer. I could try to bring in Charlotte, just have another tank. Or even go for this girl right here. I forgot her name. Oh my god, what's her name? The one that's like the budget version of Charlotte. <laughs> How did I forget her name? Ravi, Ravi, yes, Ravi, yes. Okay, thanks for watching, guys. I'm gonna stop it here, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Sorry that I didn't get the five star clear, but I just don't think I have. I'm about to go to sleep in a few minutes, so I don't have enough time. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one.